Hello everyone. Welcome back to my Unreal Engine tutorial series on how to create an open world game. So today what I am going to do is I am going to show you how to keep these characters back straight vertical uh, independent from the slant or slope of the ground. So as you can see here this horse is walking on a slanted surface but the back of the character is still or a vertical so as you can see here the back is correcting so that's what I'm going to show you today so I'm trying to add some realistic effects uh, but we are so far away from that some realistic horse riding so this is one more steps toward that and as always this episode is sponsored by these generous patreons thank you very much for the support you guys are giving me in the current version this is how the rider sits on the horse when in a slanted ground so how can we fix that for that I'll show you the socket that I am attaching the rider this one this is the socket and it is called rider location and it's a it's up vector is like this and when the horse is slanted like this the rider location should also change to match its uh, up vector properly. So actually that's uh, this is the up vector or the Z direction in the word locate word space in the local space it is this green arrow. So the green arrow should be facing upward. So let's fix it. So just like we tweaked our horse pelvis bone, can we do the same for a rider socket? that socket is not available here so therefore let's see yeah but we can change rotate this uh, neck and also it would be better if the horse neck is keep kept straight to match with the horizontal but we can't rotate the neck as it rotates the legs as well so we can rotate this part and then again so yeah now what I should do is I should attach this rider location to the neck one instead of neck so let's do that and I'm not sure what are the other problems that would introduce but let's see right so the location is changed I'll switch to the world location and fix the location like this right and also in the previous case the green arrow was facing upward but here it's not so let's rotate this to fix that like this now green arrow is facing upward and do we have any other problems I think no right let's test and see if everything is okay Right, it seems we are okay, but I think we should move the character a little bit to the 
type word. Let's do that. Right. And check again. Still not good enough. Well, it seems that's not going to work because as the uh, head is moving forward when the horse is galloping, so this character is kind of lifting up. So therefore, that approach is not going to work. Work. So let's simply revert it. Let me revert it. Okay, done. So now. What are the other ways that we can achieve the same effect? So here we have the We have calculated the rotation that require Actually we did in the last episode if you are not sure you can refer to that So we need to access this same rotation change and apply it to the horse character the rider uh, but I don't see any other way to get this calculation into my blueprint uh, actually I could uh, add a new function with the return type in BPI animation or something BPI animation interface but I'm not going to do it because that's not a clean way so I'll just copy this part and go to ch horse and here I'll add a new function called uh, calculate ground slope and here I'll paste it and this I'll return this angle I'll name it slope compile ok we have an error that's yeah we can use this mesh and let's get rid of this right now we have the same calculation here actually we are doing the same thing twice that's not good I don't like it but for now I'm gonna keep it let's see a better alternative later right now let's check the event graph and under tick if get rider and if the rider is valid we should do this only if there is a valid rider yeah, if the rider is valid mm -mm. we can adjust the rotation of this uh, rider location spring arm not spring arm this rider location scene component because that's the one that's the component I am attaching the rider so to keep the rider straight okay so let's go to the event graph and if the rider is valid I'm gonna call this function get ground slope and get this one set rotation I think we should set the relative location rotation set relative rotation 
I'm, I'm going to give the x as 90 because that's the value I already have and y 0 and z I'm going to feed this value. Let's split this so it's clear this one uh, not that one right let's check the way we have done yeah we should feed pitch and in here we should be feed pitch to Z and let's check how that works Okay, the rider is in straight. Rider's back is straight, vertical. Right, so I think it's yeah, I think it's working, but we have a small problem. The problem is this character doesn't look organic at all. So let's add some let's add some lerp in here so it wouldn't what should be the previous value get relative rotation split and Z and the alpha let's try something like 0.1 so instead of straight go up go correcting the angle of the character quickly it will have some damping okay Now you can see the character is fixed in the rotation and yeah all right so that's all i want to do for today and i'll upload the updated source code into my patreon you can take a look if you like and also if you want to support my work you can get the membership of my patreon club and depending on the tier you join you will have different privileges as i have explained in this section okay see you in the next episode in the next episode i hope to implement the host ik system right goodbye